and thank you so much for tuning in on the Maylie Behind the Scenes podcast. This is Becca, and today I'm here with... Larissa. Larissa. Nice to see you again. Yay. Super nice excited. I'm super excited. Okay, now let's get to little, know you a little bit. Um, tell us a little bit of things you like to do besides modeling and acting. Huh. Well, I am a child mentor and enthusiast. Really? Yes. I love teaching children and watching them grow. But also in my spare time, I'm learning how to garden. I love exercising Mm -hmm. and traveling. Super cool. What's your favorite place to travel to? Huh. We just came from Washington, D.C. So I think right now (laughs) that would be my favorite place right now. Yes, I want to go back. Yes. The weather there was like super nice. It was super nice. It's kind of like the last day was a little bit kind of like drizzling. But... Uh I want to go back without kids. I do. Oh. <laughs> yes, I do. I want to go back in general. <laughs> Two hour fly, who can be that? Right, 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 right. That's great. Awesome. Now, what made you enroll to Melee? You started coming this year, right? Yes, that was my New Year's resolution and I accomplished it. I love that. still a lot to do, a lot to learn. Well, I realized that I need some boost of confidence mm-hmm. and why not to start with a drama classes yeah sure. so I toured the Maley school mm-hmm. everybody was so happy and welcoming so I decided why not let me just dip my toes in the water right. and try and see what takes me and it took me into rolling into one program and then the next and then another program one, and then, then another one and then your kids started and coming my kids yes. and soon I'm gonna roll my husband <laughs> just kidding <laughs> No, tell us a little bit about the programs you attended. I know you started off with the makeup classes with Chanel, right? Yes, I've done the Chanel classes. I've done the acting classes. Mm-hmm. And then I've done the modeling class. And you did some fashion shows. I did the fashion show, yes. Yes. Uh, and I really enjoyed it. It really helped me to shape my self-image. Right, right, right. And helped me with my self-confidence with the other side of me and uh, feeling overall comfortable and yes. open. Yes. <laughs> it was great. Yay. Now, what were your favorite things about the classes you took? I know you said confidence and how about like the people, the environment? I loved it. I loved it. It was so much fun. Mm-hmm. And uh, just watching everybody grow and improving their skills. We just had fun. We built relationships mm-hmm. and... It's very uh, family-like. Yes. That's a family-like environment. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, I know your two fantastic kids come here. Tell us a little bit about Alex and Anastasia. Well, my baby Alex is the one who has, um, well, who has a little bit uh, delay in his speech because of he has impairment. So he was lacking in his social development. He was very shy and he didn't know how to be with other people. So being in the acting program helped him to boost his confidence. Mm-hmm. People who were there, if students, they saw him and they were, oh, he's so cute. Can I hug <laughs> your son? And it helped him so much. He Aww. was performing and talking. I was just so glad. And Anastasia, she's not liking anything. So she started with a modeling program, something that she really enjoyed. Mm-hmm. It's, uh, she doesn't need any boost of confidence. She had plenty <laughs> she could share. But uh, her image, she's expressing herself even better in a variety of so many ways. It was, it was great. And then um, Anastasia and Alex both went to take uh, more of the acting classes. Anastasia took singing classes. Mm-hmm. So in the advanced program, an advanced program. So kind of like development, development, development. Because you know, in life, whatever happens, the only thing you can't lose is the skills that you learned. That is awesome, and I think a lot of people should take that into account with life. Yeah. Now. Would you recommend the Melee School to others? Well, absolutely. <laughs> I brought my friend here because... Oh, uh, right! You yes. guys are in classes together, right? Yes, yes. And uh, I started the class again because I know there's always things to learn and right. improve. Mm-hmm. And uh, because she was a little shy to start herself. And she loved it. Yay. And I have another yeah. friend who is really, really shy. <laughs> it wants to do that. And... Uh, well, we'll see how that goes. Well, I'm excited to see how the rest of your journey goes. They just need to take a first step. Exactly. The first step is the hardest. The first step but is you take to it, make the commitment. Uh, yes. Right. And then you just ride the wave. Ride the wave. Yay. And now, is modeling and acting the thing you want to do? Like, as a side career, is this something you really want to get into? Why not? 
Why not? It's never too late to start. Why not? That's like the biggest misconception too. Like some people like, oh, maybe I'm a little too old to do this or maybe I'm not cut out for this. But this industry is so built for so many variety of different people and so many yeah. different looks and ages yeah. and ethnicities yeah. and everything like yeah. that. Yeah, I agree with you. Absolutely. Yay. There's uh, all kind of ages of playing in the movies and in commercials. In commercials. So why limit yourself? Exactly. Why not? I agree. <laughs> no, thank you so much for joining me today. Well, thank you for inviting me. It was fun. Of course. That is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching and joining. And we will see you next time on the Melee Behind the Scenes podcast. Yay! Bye! Bye!